correct? You know, like I said earlier, Amy is over in the Model City this morning for National Small Business Week, and that is where we find her getting ready to take us for a visit to some of the newest small businesses located there in Kingsport. Good morning, Amy. Uh, hey, Chris, good morning. It is a beautiful morning to be here, of course. Yes, live in downtown Kingsport celebrating small businesses. You know, we are so blessed with downtowns that have incredible, independent, locally owned small businesses adding to the variety that we get to see. And we have Robin Cleary here joining us from the Downtown Kingsport Association. It's a celebration of small businesses. Absolutely, this week. all week long. I mean, we celebrate them all year, but this week's the time to draw attention to them and the investment that they make in our communities. Um, you know, over um, half of all Americans are uh, employed at a small business. They are the backbone of our economy, uh, definitely the backbone of the local economy. So, um, you know, down, our downtowns, what will we be without our small business op owners and operators? I certainly believe that. The blessing of a downtown area, yeah. a vibrant downtown area. And we're going to have some fun today. Yeah. Because Robin and I are going to hop across the street. We're talking new businesses. We're going to go to East Tennessee Jelly Ball, which I can't wait. We're going to get our fancy yeah. goggles safety on. Gear. We're going to have our safety <laughs> gear. We're going to have some fun there. And then we're going to a new place called Dapper Dudes. All that and more coming up, Chris, as we hop around and celebrate small businesses here in our area. All right, Amy, we are looking forward to checking out some of those new businesses there in downtown Kingsport. We'll be heading back over there to Kingsport in just a few minutes. And today on the show,